Hi, Diana Alexander here with another San Bernardino County COVID-19 news update. I'm happy to have as my guest again, Mr. Michael Stoffel, preeminent real estate agent here in the Inland Empire. He is going to talk to individuals in the real estate business about how to conduct business in the midst of a COVID-19 crisis. Welcome, Michael. Michael, could you talk with real estate agents who are concerned about conducting business during this crisis? Consumers will feel more comfortable buying and selling when the realtor leads by example and with certainty and confidence rather than fear. Please have available for clients masks, gloves, hand sanitizers, and booties when needed. These are the new tools of our trade. Thank you, Michael, for sharing that encouragement for other real estate agents in our county. I also understand that you've been taking advantage of using many emerging technologies when it comes to showing homes virtually, uh, even staging homes. Could you share some information about how you're doing that? Yes, a strong digital presence is essential. It's not optional. I've invested in unique property websites for all of my listings, 3D tours, walking tours, even virtual staging when appropriate. My marketing team then promotes the different marketing links all across different social media platforms and third-party sites, ensuring maximum exposure. I think it's so amazing that you've been able to leverage technology in this way. But I also understand that you've been using other kinds of technology like e-signing of documents. Talk to us a little bit about how that works out for you. I really enjoy the fact that the majority of buyers and sellers are embracing electronic signatures. It's more efficient, faster, and safer. We have increased the already used electronic signing, meaning we can go over offers, listing contracts, disclosures, and anything that needs to be signed over Zoom or on the phone, and then we can send the clients to sign them electronically via a few different e-sign platforms. We are closing sales totally paperless, and in some cases, the buyers are not seeing their new home until the final walkthrough or when they move in. Could you also address how sellers and buyers have responded to you using this type of technology, especially when it comes to things like closing and doing all kinds of things basically in a virtual environment? 80% of buyers and sellers appreciate that we offer paperless and virtual solutions. The other 20% are provided amazing customer service using more traditional tools and systems to ensure both their safety and success. Thank you so much, Michael, for everything you've shared. Do you have any final words of encouragement, not just for people in the real estate industry, but for small businesses, period? Three months ago, I never dreamed my business practices would be what they are today. Fortunately, I was able to adapt and we are now helping more families than ever before. I strongly believe that no matter what your beliefs are, you need to adapt and make your clients or customer feel comfortable and safe. I read a quote recently attributed to Abraham Lincoln that I feel is very powerful and appropriate for all business owners today. Those that may be feeling uncertainty about their future. The quote is, the most reliable way to predict the future is to create it. Thank you so much for the chance to share this information today, Diana. If anybody has any questions at all, I'm available at the phone number and email below. Please make sure to check for updates as new information becomes available frequently. Thank you very much. Wow. I am so glad that you joined us today to provide such valuable information for our real estate industry and for businesses at large. Thank you so much, Michael. This has been another San Bernardino County COVID-19 news update. Until next time, please stay safe and take care.